Huh, must be underground. Guess it's time for some urban spelunking. <laughs> Hi, David. Just found another hammerhead hideout. Please, be careful. I will. So, what happens when we get all the caches? Put some stamps on them and celebrate at Eddie's Pizza? <laughs> Eddie's, yes. I will miss that place. He's not going out of business, is he? Please tell me he's not. <laughs> no, no. It's just... It's nothing. And do not worry about shit. I will take care of it when the time comes. Seriously, Hammerhead's guys aren't great conversationalists. Back home, I was a math teacher. I wanted to open my students' eyes to the possibilities beyond our village. Even when the Red Uprising began and people started leaving the village, my students still came to school. And yet, if I had known what was to come, I would have acted differently. It happened in the morning, right as school began. There were nine of them. All with automatic rifles. They asked for names, but I would not keep any. Their patience wore out. They raised their rifles to shoot me. And that's when she came in. Who? Silva Silva. She took out the whole group. She saved me and the children. And that is why I owe her my life. Wow. For a heartless mercenary, she's sometimes almost like a
Looks like I cleared the place out. Whew. Now to find the supply cache for David. This must be the cache of humanitarian aid. Okay, David. Found a bunch more supplies here. I'll send you the location. You are doing a great thing. Each supply cache could save hundreds of some carrion lives. Why Simcaria, if you don't mind me asking? I merely wish to help the children of Simcaria, as I once failed to help those who relied on me most. Thank you again for finding those supplies. I will come by to get them soon. Hmm. Sounds like David's carrying around a little guilt. Like most of us, I guess. I'm getting close. It has to be Yuri who's leaving all this stuff. The police ruled this a suicide. But Yuri had her doubts. The victim was part of Hammerhead's crime family. These case files are getting more and more recent. This one happened just a few weeks ago. You seem nervous. Yeah, well, the chief knew I was working undercover with you. I can't afford to lose my job. Maybe I should be the one doing three exercises. Isn't that interesting? Don't worry. I won't tell you this. Also, you're doing great. You're a very authentic looking doctor. Thanks. I think. You think he knows you were wearing a wire? If he does, he's a hell of a good liar. He's a Magia enforcer. We know he's a good liar. Question is, does he know he's being lied to? We'll find out tomorrow, I guess. You sure about all this? When we catch him in the act of trying to murder a police officer, he gets put away for life. Yuri, what are you doing? I have to find her. The entrance to his hideout must be somewhere close by. There's the entrance. Clever. <laughs> Hi, David. I think I found the last hideout. Great work. So, I was thinking, maybe we should store the caches at a local police precinct, just for safekeeping. I would prefer to safeguard them myself. I get the sense you're not telling me something. <sighs> I had a work visa with Sable International. It became invalid when I quit. 
Even an ID check right now could mean immediate deportation. I merely wish to finish this one task, and then I will go. Maybe I could help you with the whole immigration thing. Do not worry for me. This was my choice, and I have no regrets. Somebody Someone needs a nap. in the city? Well, I know someone who might be a good fit. If you had a visa. I think some of the supers are offering H1Bs based on credentials. Send me his info and I'll call around. I'm curious. When you guys get food delivered, do they just drop it down a sewer drain or what? Those humanitarian supplies should be around here somewhere. Time to find that stash of humanitarian aid.
Okay. Those humanitarian supplies should be around here somewhere. There are the supplies. David, the final supply caches are secure. Thank you. I will take them all to the Simkarian Embassy and make sure the aid is delivered. Let me know if there's anything else I can do to help. I will. And thank you once more, Spider-Man. Guess that's it. Hope MJ can pull some strings for him. Hey, David, what's up? Spider-Man, I have the supply caches and I'm on my way to the embassy, but I think I am being followed. Where are you? I am not sure. I am... David! David! Hold on! I'm on my way! Hammerhead's men knew David would be alone and vulnerable. I should have seen this coming. Hang in there, David. Yuri's been here. Now where's the file? I think there was a hit and run here recently. The victim was set to testify against one of Hammerhead's men. But of course, police never found a suspect. Hey, Captain. You ready for this? Ready as I'll ever be. I'm all wired up on my way to the office. Just picking up a coffee first. Okay. Drinks are on me when this is done. <laughs> Looking forward to it, Captain. Yuri's suspended, but she still won't give up. Hard not to respect that. Hi, can I just get a large coffee? Hey, Dad, uh, Dad. Who's that you were just talking to? Oh. Hey. <laughs> Unknown number. Hello? Hello, old friend. Yuri? Meet me at the corner of Madison at 23rd. We need to talk. Wait, wait, Yuri! Ah, she's gone. Look at all that's happened to Yuri. She must be beyond hurting. She doesn't do anything without a reason. So why did she leave me on a grisly crime scene tour? She must have a lead on this enforcer guy. It'll be nice to see her. Maybe help her deal with whatever she's dealing with. Enforcer, dead. And the case files from all his victims. This guy killed all these people. But does that mean he deserved to die? Yuri! I know what you're gonna say, but just hear me out. The system works most of the time, but there are times when it doesn't. And to me, that's unacceptable. Some people put their trust in fate, or karma, or whatever. But I can only trust me. You can't kill people, Yuri. Apparently I can. And you know what? It felt good. You need to turn yourself in. For what? I just dispensed justice. True justice. And I restored a little bit of balance to the world. You're my friend, Yuri. I don't want to come after you. 
You do what you have to do, and I'll do what I have to do. Goodbye, Spider-Man. Yuri! Tom, what am I gonna do? This all makes sense now. What Yuri did to Hammerhead. She's been struggling with this for a while. She's always held in her emotions. That must take a toll on her. But she's also the most tenacious and stubborn person I know. This was a bad guy for sure, but killing him? That's too much. Okay, Screwball must be here somewhere. Unless she's faking me out again. This feels like a party she'd want to attend. Hey, y'all! Screwball! Don't move! Come on! The world is watching! Just because people are watching, it doesn't mean you're any better of a person! Wow, mood killer! Try to keep the banter right in front, okay? Everybody's got drones these days. Oh, watch out! Or don't. It's entertaining either way. <laughs> Get that! Scratch one drone. Time to get close and finish this. I guess there's no po You only caught me because I wanted you to catch me! Look how many followers I gained! Yes! You guys know who I am, right? <laughs> of course you do. Mind if I live stream on the way to the station? Officially unfollowed.
There's David. He's in trouble. Gotta move. Hi, David. You look like you could use a little help. David, stay where you are. I got this. Almost there. You still good? You okay? I think so. Thank God for this sable armor. So, what's next? Deliver the caches to the Simkarian embassy. Thanks to you, the Simkarians will finally get the aid they need. Just happy I could help. But I meant what's next for you? Well, a few minutes ago I received a call from a school in Midtown. They offered me a visa if I accepted a teaching position. I don't suppose you had something to do with that. Good things happen to good people. I can't thank you enough. I will try every day to help my students achieve their dreams, as you have helped me achieve mine. Actually, I should be the one thanking you. For what? For reminding me why I'll always love this city. Is it me, or is the world a little brighter right now? I'm just gonna bask in this good feeling for at least the next few seconds. Or until something else bad happens. I bet David's gonna be one of those cool teachers whose classes are packed. <laughs>